So the Vols handle business today against UTEP. No surprise there. A 56 to nothing win. Started off, I guess, a little bit slower than I would have wanted to, but I mean, in the grand scheme of things, whether we, I mean, whether we were up 56 to nothing and didn't score any in the fourth, or we didn't score any in the first, I mean, it didn't. It, it wasn't going to matter. Uh, we did what we needed to do to beat them. Season's going to hang in the balance next weekend. Everything's there for this team. Uh, playoff committee showed that they're a joke on Tuesday night. They, they make no sense. Um, they love Alabama. We beat Alabama. At the end, at, at the end of the day, if uh, we and Alabama are 10-2, and two, Tennessee should be ranked ahead of Alabama. And, like, what's going to happen if – like, can you imagine the ramifications if – they give Alabama an eight seed and Tennessee a nine seed, and we beat them. Like we should not, we should not have to go on the road. But I mean, that's probably what's going to happen. Um, Ole Miss lost today, season done. And I just, I don't understand the playoff like committee because they're fixing to give Notre Dame a five seed. Notre Dame season should have been over when they lost to Northern Illinois. I just, I do not understand that. It does not make any sense. It's just like, it's like you see, like, what are they devaluing? Do they value wins, losses? I mean, I, the one thing I know is that they devalue the orange. Like, it, it, it don't make no sense. Um, Sad, sad day today. BBD, we lost BBD. He passed away, I think, last night. Um, that's, that's the whole reason I started making videos back in, like, 2010, 2011. I saw the BBD video. My first, the first video I remember out of Big Ball Daddy was the uh, when we lost Alabama, the Mount Cody block. Uh, that's the video I remember, and I've been watching like that was the early days of the TTC, and then you know that kind of dissolved. But he's just he's always been making videos. Um, this, I mean, y'all know like had health problems here recently. It just it just sucks, you know, because um, I mean he's been on here for probably fifteen years. So y'all just be thinking about his daughter and just the, his family and everybody. There's a lot of people. Like he touched. He he came across a lot of people over the years. Um, so it's just it was sad to hear that news this morning. But I guess hopefully, um, hopefully Tennessee just keeps winning this year. Um, that's you know that's. It's just sad. I mean, there's so much more to life than sports, and it just really puts things into perspective, honestly. Um, we, we value sports way too much. We let it affect our – it's the highest of highs and the lowest of lows. And, I mean, at the end of the day, it's just a game. Like, what does it really matter? But, like I said, um, I've been – I watched BBD for a long time. Um, I just always enjoyed his content. I met him a couple of times. Um, I don't remember what year it was. He came down to Murfreesboro, and we watched a Greenville basketball state tournament game. That was pretty fun. But, like I said, just rest in peace, BBD. Um, that's really all I got for y'all today. Not much not much Tennessee-wise. Uh, like I said, the season's going to come down to can we beat Vanderbilt and West End next week? You know, they beat Alabama. We'll just have to see. Um we beat Vanderbilt. I don't think there's any way the committee can hold us out, especially seeing as how Ole Miss lost today. I mean, it just and Indiana lost. Just it opened the door, even as us a 10, 11, 12 seed. We ain't. I mean, I'm not complaining. It would be so good to have a home game. But if you would have told, like that was the goal of this year was the playoffs, and it's just it's all right there. So whether this team wants it or not, so. Sitting nine and two, got a good opportunity to finish ten and two, and like I said, anything can happen in the playoffs. So, go balls, go balls, screw y'all. Is in the words of BVD, y'all have a good one. <laughs>